So when you talk about the economy, of course, it is by far the most important issue for voters. It's also true right now, Mr. President, that voters by a wide margin trust Trump more on the economy. They say that in polls. And part of the reason for that may be the numbers. And, and, and you're aware of many of these, of course. Uh, the cost of buying a home in the United States is double uh, what it was when you look at your monthly costs from before the pandemic. Real income, when you account for inflation, is actually down since you took office. Economic growth last week, far short of expectations. Consumer confidence, maybe no surprise, is near a two-year low. With less than six months to go to Election Day, are you worried that you're running out of time to turn that around? We've created more jobs. We've made we're in a situation where people have access to good paying jobs. And the last I saw, the combination of the inflation, the, the cost of inflation, all those things, that's really worrisome to people with good reason. That's why I'm working very hard to bring the cost of rentals down, to increase the number of homes that are available. But let me say it this way. We have the strongest economy in the world. Let me say it again, in the world. Although GDP last week was far short of expectations. Oh, it wasn't. Look, GDP is still gro- Look at the response of the markets. Overwhelmingly positive. Well, so, but I mean, no president's had the run we've had in terms of creating jobs and bringing down inflation. It was 9% when I came to office. 